Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Nick Gray, and today we're back with another camera comparison with the Nothing Phone 1. Now, I've already compared this to Google's Pixel 6a, which is kind of a fair comparison between those two devices, but today we're gonna step things up by comparing it to the Pixel 6 Pro, which is a flagship tier device and considered what to be one of the best smartphones on the market for capturing photos and videos. So without further ado, let's jump in to see how these two devices compare in everyday use. If you're not familiar with the specifications of these two devices, the Nothing Phone 1 has two 50 megapixel sensors on the back of the device that can capture 4K video at 30 frames per second. Well, that front facing selfie camera is a 16 megapixel sensor that's limited to 1080p 30 FPS video capture. As for the Pixel 6 Pro, it features a 50 megapixel sensor for its main camera as well, but then it also has a 48 megapixel 4X telephoto zoom camera and then a 12 megapixel ultra wide camera on the back as well. As for its selfie camera, it's an 11.1 megapixel sensor, but that one can actually capture 4K video at 30 frames per second. I mentioned this right from the very beginning that the Nothing Phone 1 doesn't have 4K video capture from its selfie camera. And honestly, for a mid-range device, it's not a huge deal because there aren't even that many flagship tier smartphones that have 4K video capture from their selfie cameras. But you can definitely see the difference in dynamic range here on the Pixel device. The sky is actually blue as opposed to being completely washed out on the Nothing Phone 1. Of course, recording outdoors is always gonna be the better experience with these devices, but you can definitely see that the Pixel 6 Pro has much better dynamic range than what you get on the Nothing Phone 1. You can see a lot of the detail in the tree here with that ultra wide camera. Let's switch over to that main one to see what we can see. And here we go with that main camera. Definitely a lot better on the Nothing Phone 1 than it was before, but Google's device does seem to have just a little bit more color and contrast there as well.
it comes to video capture from the selfie cameras on both of these devices in the low light situations like this, the Pixel 6 Pro does have the advantage here. The Nothing Phone 1 does brighten up the scene quite a bit, but you will notice if you take a closer look, there is a lot of grain in that shot. You definitely want to make sure that you have a lighting source in front of you, kind of like this right now as I'm stepping into the light here. This does make it a lot better when you're recording video in situations like this. And that's gonna do it for this camera comparison between Google's Pixel 6 Pro and the Nothing Phone 1, a device that costs less than half of what Google's flagship device costs. So let me know what you think of the results in the comments below and whether or not you would choose the Pixel 6 Pro or the Nothing Phone 1 to capture your photos and videos. I do have more camera comparisons with the Nothing Phone 1 coming up, so make sure you subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.